What's up, Nation Pills here? I want to bring you guys this article because I thought it was pretty cool. So I'm going to have a link down in the description below if you guys want to check this article out. But it's saying top reasons to back Nintendo in 2015. So we all know Nintendo did have a kind of a great year this year. At the Video Games Awards, you know, they won a lot of different stuff. You know, I think Nintendo won the most trophies out of everyone. And I'm kind of glad this is happening because Nintendo need to come back. Nintendo wasn't a bad console. It wasn't, a, you know, a bad company. It just made old decisions. I feel like Nintendo don't know the new generation. They're stuck in the old generation. And once they figure out, you know, the new generation is here and they need to, you know, adapt to the new generation, I feel like they will be a lot better. So I'm going to give you guys the 10 reasons off this website to back Nintendo in 2015. So number one is Captain Toad Treasure Tracker. Not a game I'm into. You know, Mario, any Mario character, I'm really not into Mario like that no more. Um, but if you into this and you love this, back Nintendo in 2015. The next one is Star Fox. I remember playing Star Fox on Nintendo 64 and I thought it was pretty fun. Um, it's not one of those games that I would like say I loved, um, but it is fun. So if you like Star Fox, support Nintendo in 2015. Um, number three is Legend of Zelda. Now I'm glad this is on this list because this is the reason why I wanted Wii U. The Legend of Zelda, I played it on N64 and I loved that damn. I beat that game like straight through it like i woke up the first thing i did was put zelda on i didn't think of anything else like i love zelda so it's great to see zelda coming to the wii u like i said this is the game that will make me buy a wii u so when, hopefully when this game come out nintendo has a lot of games on the wii u so i don't have to just buy a console and get one game but in my opinion zelda will be the best game on the wii u in 2015. Number four is Yoshi World. Now, like I said, Mario again, but I do like Yoshi. Yoshi is kind of fun. Um, so I probably would pick this game out if I do get a Wii U. I won't pick any Mario game, but it probably would be a Donkey Kong game, Zelda game, and probably this Yoshi game. Just because they do look cool. So if you like, like I said, if you like Mario, Yoshi, um, what's that other guy name? Captain Toad, get a Wii U in 2015. Number five on here is Kirby. Now, Kirby... Um, I like the show. Don't get me wrong. I did like Kirby the show. Um, I'm kind of glad Nintendo got Kirby. And I'm not going to get this game. I'm going to let you guys know now. I'm not going to get this game. Just because um, it's just not my type of game. Like I said, I liked the show when I was younger. But now, you know, growing up and getting away from all that stuff, I'm not really into Kirby. But if you are, make sure you get Kirby and the Rainbow Paintbrush. Number six is Splatoon. Um, didn't really look at this game. What this website is saying, it's a four-on-four third-person multiplayer shooter for Nintendo. So I, I guess it's like just a regular shooter. Might be fun. You know, I'm into like third-person multiplayer shooter. So I probably will check this game out. Number seven is Xenoblade Chronicles X. Um, it's another game that um, I haven't really checked out, but it is RPG. They said it's probably one of the best games on the Wii U that's coming out. And actually, I, actually no, I do know this game because I remember seeing this game and I said, this is the game I'm going to get on my Wii U. So yes, this game so yes, this game will be one of the games I will pick up when I get a Wii U. This game looks amazing. I have a link down description below to all the trailers so you guys can check this out. But make sure you check out this game because this game is amazing. Number eight is Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate. Um not a game I'm really into. Um but if you're into that, make sure you guys get a Wii U for that. Uh, let me know what's the best thing about Monster Hunter. It just looked boring to me. Be honest with you guys, I did not really like it. Um but let me know. Number nine is The Legend of Zelda Majora Mask. If I'm correct, this was on the N64. If I'm correct, let me know in the comments below if I'm wrong or right. But if last time I checked, this was on the N64. So I probably will pick this one up. Um, I did play this Zelda, but um, yeah, I'd probably get it just for that. But it's gonna be on the Nintendo. It's gonna be on the Nintendo 3DS. Hopefully, it's on the Wii U because I'd rather play it on a console than a handheld. Um, but let me know in the comments below what you guys think. And number ten is Code Name Steam. Nothing against Code Name Steam, but Code Name Steam is boring to me like the gameplay was just boring i did not like it straight off the bat i did not like it it's not a game i would play it's not a game i would download if it was free i'll probably try it out but i can't see me playing it again um so yeah that's number 10 if you guys like this list make sure you subscribe i feel like nintendo will come out in 2015 and dominate i feel like ps4 would dominate better but nintendo will come out i feel like nintendo they know they have to step it up they know they have to step it up or they will be left behind this generation. This is your year, Nintendo. Don't fuck it up. All right, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. If you enjoyed it, please like button. Make sure you subscribe if you do. Make sure you guys add me on PlayStation if you want to play with me. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitter so you can tweet me articles and stuff. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.